Hi, first graders, it's Mrs. Compton, and we're starting today with a number talk. And in my mind, when I'm doing a number talk, I am thinking about tools. I'm thinking about um, cubes, I'm thinking about my hundred chart, and I'm thinking about other things that help me with my numbers. So it's okay if you're thinking in a number talk, hmm, what would that look like with my math tools? That's what mathematicians do. Okay, so here we go. We are going to start first with 9 plus 3. Now remember, in a number talk, we're doing this mentally. We're trying to figure out, how would I solve this? All right, so hit pause right now and see what you would do. All right, hit pause. Okay, I hit pause to think about my strategy, and guess who showed up? He wanted to come up. Say hi to Chip. All right, I'm going to guess your strategies. So let's see. We've got nine plus three. I'm gonna guess some of you used your fingers. All right, so let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, so that's nine. I'm gonna change colors now so you can see, I'm gonna use bright pink. So you can see the three. So this is nine, and then we have to add a thumb. So that's two whole hands, and then Two more, so we've got 9, 10, 11, 12. So 9 plus 3 makes 12. Okay, I'm gonna guess that some of you found a friendly. Did anybody find a friendly? Chip, did you find a friendly? Okay, let's see. How many toes do you have? One, two, three, four, five. He does have five toes on the front paws and only one, two, three, four on the back paws. Oh my gosh. So you only have 18 toes. He's not like us. He doesn't have 20 toes. All right, so did anyone use fingers? You didn't have to use toes for this one. Um, but I'm going to guess that some of you used your fingers and made a friendly number, and others of you just thought, here comes a friendly. So maybe you thought about you could steal one from the three and break it into one and two. That still makes three, right? One and two. So maybe you could do that and then steal one and make a friendly number. So now we have 10 plus 2 makes 12. Okay, I have another guess. Did anybody use a number line? I bet some of you did. Love number lines. All right, Chip, what do you say? You want to say goodbye? Bye. Bye-bye. He can sit over there. Here we go. So if we use a number line, we could start it with nine and then count on three more. Nine, 10, 11, 12. 10, 11, 12. And each hop was worth one. So all together we had, we took three hops and we landed at 12. Okay, um, here comes your next one. I'm gonna give you your next one, ready? Nine plus five. Okay, I want you to hit pause. I'm gonna hit pause too, and I wanna think about my best strategy while you think about your best strategy. I've got it. Do you have yours? I'm ready to take some guesses. I'm gonna guess some of you use that friendly again. Did anyone break the five apart? Give me a thumbs up if you did break the five apart. Let me see. Did anybody, hmm. Did anybody just count on from nine? Give me a thumbs up if you did that one. Let me see. Yep, yeah, I see some people out there. Okay, let's see. Maybe you stole one from the five. You broke it into a one and a four, and you found that friendly 10. There's my friendly 10. And then you knew 10 plus four makes 14. All right, give me a wave if you did that. Okay, um, let's do one more. I'm gonna guess that some of you probably have this chart memorized in your head. So maybe you started at nine. See if I can actually do this while I'm talking to you and holding it up. You guys, you just never know what I might accomplish. Okay, so maybe you started at nine and then you counted five more. All right, count them with me, ready? One, two, three, four, five. All right, so we have
have nine plus five makes 14. Okay, you guys, are you ready to hear your story? I'm ready. All right, here we go. We've got somebody to say hello to at Penny Camp and Mrs. Price's class. We're going to say hello to Tyler W. Hi, Tyler. Tyler, I hope you like comic books because that's what this story is about. Tyler W. wrote, hmm, comic books. Clay wrote, hmm, more comic books than Tyler W. Okay, so, so far we know that Tyler and Clay both wrote comic books. Now, who wrote more? It says Clay wrote, hmm, more comic books. So if this is Clay, he wrote more than Tyler, right? How many comic books did Clay write? All right. So we have our number sets here to think about. So we've got two and eight. We've got seven and 15. We've got 55 and 17. So let's think about this. I want to think about this with some numbers. Let's do two and eight. Tyler W. wrote two comic books. Okay. Clay wrote eight more comic books than Tyler W. Okay, so if Clay wrote eight more than Tyler, we have to figure out how many did Clay write. Okay, so he didn't write eight books. I actually took a pause when I was reading this and I was like, isn't the answer just eight? Didn't he just read eight books? But that's not really true. He read eight more than Tyler. All right, kids, you know the drill. You have to pick the numbers that feel right to you, right? They're not gonna feel just right to your best friend or maybe your neighbor or your parents. They have to feel just right to you. So make sure you pick your just right number set and I'll see you next time. Bye.